Do you know that Portugal has one of the top beaches in the world? I lived for a while in Portugal. I had the opportunity to the first hand experience and live the culture, which is why I choose to search more and talk about it. I choose Portugal for the beauty of history, rich architecture, and very interesting culture. First, I will tell you about Portugal itself and Portugal history. Second, I will tell you about communication behavior. Lastly, I will tell you about the country culture. Let me begin telling you some information about Portugal itself and Portugal history. Portugal is in Southeast Western Europe. I consulted the nation's online website to have more information about Portugal. According to the entry Portugal found in Nation Online, last update in 2010, in the section entitled Portugal, it states that Portugal covers an area of 92,000 kilometers square and compared to US is smaller than the state of Indiana. The most western European state has a short line at the Atlantic Ocean, it's bordered to the north and to the east by only one country, Spain. Portugal shares a maritime border with Morocco in North Africa. Portugal has a population of 10.3 million of people. The capital and largest city is Lisbon with about 500,000 inhabitants. The official language is Portuguese. Even though commonly referred as Portugal, the country official name is Portuguese Republic or Republica Portuguesa. As independent kingdom in 143, Portugal establishes its continental frontiers in 1097 and is one of the oldest nations in Europe. The former world power during the 5th and 6th centuries lost much of his, we of his wealth and status with the destruction of, of Lisbon in 170-55 earthquake. Uh, one, in 1910, revolution deposed the monarchy for the most of six decades repressive governments around the country in 1040, 1074 a left-wing military install installed broad democratic reforms the following year portugal granted independence to all its african colonies now that i told you about portugal itself and portugal history let me move on to communication behavior portuguese are well known for their warm and welcome be behavior and vivid form of communication. According to Culture Grams 2020, broadcast online edition in the article entitled Portugal and in the section Customs in, Cortes in, in Courtesy, the report states that friends often hug among relatives and friends, and sometimes even new acquaintances. Men and women give each other beijinhos, little kisses, on the, on the cheek, beginning with the right. At a young age, kids are taught to express their feelings lively starting from their greetings. Children are expected to kiss adults in the, an extended family when greeting them. Portuguese people reflect and uh, feel connected with some uh, with someone saying that touch is a very important factor in their communication. Touching is a common part of greeting because it shows friendship. Not a lot of people know, but Portuguese people, as the Italians, use a lot of physical gestures during conversation. To beckon, one waves our fingers, the palm facing up is um, important to point directly at the person with the index finger. Pulling down your skin just below your eyes, index finger can be used 
ironically to mean you smart, spreading the fingers, palm down, and rocking the hand meaning more or less. I've told about Portugal itself, Portugal history, and communication behavior. Now let me talk about the culture. Portuguese people are known for the history of being workers and fighters. According to Gant Offset and Michael Minkoff, search on the page, What About Portugal? Last update in 2010, Portuguese society is competitive and with success being defined by the best in the area. Portuguese people valorize family, friendship, trying to extend the maximum possible of a relationship. This is a manifest in a close long-term commitment to the member group to be to be that a family, extended family or extended relationship. Loyalty is very important also in the Portuguese collective culture. Loyalty is a collective culture, is a paramount and overrides most of the societies and regulations. Portuguese culture relates relates a lot to sports, especially soccer. You might have know the best soccer player in the world is Portuguese, and they are the cur the current uh, uh, European soccer champion. Cristiano Ronaldo is a Portuguese soccer player who is currently the best in the world, and has won uh, the total of cinco, uh, of five times the price in Portugal soccer is mandatory every kid plays soccer in a team and when the national team plays the country stops with that said about Portugal let me conclude by renew some important points first I told you about Portugal itself Portugal history then I told you about amazing Portugal uh, architecture and communication behaviors and lastly, I told you about Portuguese culture. So if you know history, and if you love history, go visit Portugal today. Impressive and strong culture. Thank you very much. Come on.